it still has that new school smell. Just put it on top of the fridge. After a year of construction, Fairhope High School now has 20 new classrooms, complete with textbooks, globes, and state-of-the-art smart boards. For some, it may not seem like a big deal, but for students and staff, it means a lot. It's going to be really nice, and also, I really like the new desk. The new desks are a lot bigger, so there's more space for like your notes and the books. But we just continue to grow, and our kids are just pushing it to the max, and our teachers have been so patient during this whole transition. With this new addition, school leaders will be able to get rid of outside portables that were put on campus to help with overcrowding. For parents like Carrie Mackey, that's a big relief. I understood. Uh, the need for the portables, you've got to put these students somewhere, but in terms of safety and, uh, and, and quality of environment to learn in, this is so much better. Officials say on average, the student population is growing by about 2% each year. The school board approved a $60 million proposal to expand schools all over Baldwin County and build two new schools. Superintendent Eddie Tyler says the Fairhope High School expansion cost about $4 million, and it's all funded through the pay-as-you-go program. A borrowed money from Regions Bank for four years, no new taxes to the public, no bonding. This will be paid off in four years, so we're very excited about that. Now as everyone prepares to make the transition, they all look forward to this next step and a better future for the education of Baldwin County. In Fairhope, Devin Caffaro, Fox 10 News.